20,000 maravedis. 20,000 maravedis to the man who can make an egg stand upright. As if we had nothing better hey. to do, eh? Impossible, right? Waste of that cologne try himself. Yeah, let's see him do it. A cheat! He never told us we could crack the egg. I never said the eggshell couldn't be cracked. No one thought of it or dared to try. He's trying to make fools of us. It is ignorance and lack of courage which makes fools of men. Listen to me. I tell you that a well-disciplined ship can make this voyage. Cheap little trick. Huh? It proves nothing about the Sea of Darkness. A sea so broad, even if Cathay were on the other side. No man would live to see it. He knows what he's saying, Cologne. Listen to him. Let the man speak! The world is round, correct? <laughs> Where I stand, it will be the beginning and the end. Zero degrees and 360 degrees. Where Martin stands, 90 degrees. De La Cosa, half the globe, 180 degrees. Vicente, three quarters of the globe, 270 degrees. Can you follow that? Don't insult me, Cristobal. The length of Europe and Asia to the tip of Cathay is roughly 260 degrees. So this is Cathay. Remember, Marco Polo made this trip. And he made measurements every month. Beyond Cathay is Sepango. Let's say 28 to 30 degrees. Polo never saw Sipango. No, but he had the word of Chinese sea captains. So we can't be sure. The ocean sea is 70 degrees of the world. There are 45 miles to a degree, so it is 3,000 miles from Palos to Sipango. And 2,400 miles from the Canaries. A well-provided, a well-disciplined ship can make that. What if your figures are wrong? They are not wrong. Would you sail with him for our one? Alas, that is not possible. But if it were, there is no power on this earth saving the Holy Father. Would keep me from making this voyage of discovery. Wait. What about you, Vincent? I think I shall tell my grandchildren that I sailed the ocean sea. <laughs> <laughs> Why should a sailor loaf about in Palos when he can find houses of gold and scarves of silk for his lady? Yeah!